This video is sponsored by alternative rock artist Divine Lie. It's generally accepted that you can't copyright a song title. Anybody is free to write any song they like with any song title. It doesn't matter if it's been used before. Although I would say that sometimes it would probably be a bad idea to reuse certain song titles, for example, Bohemian Rhapsody, because that title is already so closely associated with one piece of music. If you were to write another song with that same title, it would just be a bit confusing. But at the other end of the spectrum, some titles are generic enough that they've been used time and time again, to the point that there's not really one song that's known for having that title. So today I thought it'd be interesting to go through some of the most overused song titles. Song titles that are used so much that if I said the title, you're not necessarily going to be thinking of the same song as I am. So in my research, I closed in on about 15 song titles that seem to have been used time and time again. And what I did to find out how many times they've been used is used a combination of Wikipedia and Spotify to see how many unique songs have been published under those names. And as you can see, the top five entries on this list have over a hundred songs, with the top spot taken by a title that has over 300 unique songs to its name. So let's go through those top five now, starting with Without You. As we'll find with all of the song titles on this list, Without You is an easy to understand sentiment, a very generic and universal idea, which of course has been used in countless songs. Without you, living is without you. I can live without you. Without you. It's like to be without you. In fourth position, we have Home. Once again, a very simple, easy to relate to concept. Let me go home. For showing me home, for sitting home. You know I want that home, 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 home. You know you got that home, 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 home. I gotta get home. There's a garden to tend. Number three on the list is Breathe. I was actually a little surprised to find this so high on the list. It wasn't one that initially came to mind when I started thinking of really common song titles. But I guess it's just a very generic good piece of advice that a lot of people have decided to write songs with.
The number two spot we have I Want You, a title with a pretty obvious meaning and obviously an emotion, a sentiment that lots of songwriters have been inspired by. I want you, I want you, I want you. takes us to the number one spot, which, as you can see from my numbers at least, has over double the amount of songs written about it than the second entry on the list. This is not only far and away the most common song title that I could find, but it's actually the song title that inspired me to make this video in the first place. It's Hold On. Hold on. So as you can see, all of these song titles have very generic, easy to relate to, universal sentiments in their title. And of course that's the case, there's not going to be 300 songs written with a title like Strawberry Fields Forever or Bohemian Rhapsody, because those titles are very specific, dripping in character and definition. And that is something you should really bear in mind when you title your song. If you want your song title to stand out, be memorable, have character, consider that the title is the first impression that it will often make on a listener, especially in this age of streaming when people will find songs in a playlist before they've ever heard them. 
And if you think about it, Bohemian Rhapsody, such an iconic song title, but it never once says Bohemian Rhapsody in that song. So you really can name your song anything you like, and it can make a massive difference to its success and its characterability. Of course, if you think there's a really common song title that I've missed off this list, then do leave it in the comments down below. And thank you to Divine Lie for sponsoring this video. Divine Lie are an alternative rock act from Cape Town, South Africa. They've just released their 10th studio album called Indelible Stain. Have a listen to the lead single, Feelings You Hide In Your Heart. To listen to Divine Lie, either head over to their YouTube channel or check them out on streaming services like Spotify. The links are down below in the description.